What's good y'all? This is Kaiju and today we have the Decidueye Battle Feature Figure by Jazzwas. I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. I don't know. I'll never know. But Flygon should be up soon. I do have a short um, review. When I say short, I mean like a YouTube short, 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 short review of the Luxray. And if I find Blastoise, I will do a review of that. Um, I'll probably add a short as well. This looks like it's got some cool... Um, I guess oh, bow and arrow action and Decidueye is my favorite character from that generation So I'm pretty excited to open this up and see how great it is so Let's open this up Got the Decidueye figure here um, It's just a feather. It, oh feathers attached. Oh, I gotta get some scissors. Gosh darn it and Since I'm super strong I was able just to tear that little plastic piece off and here's a little pamphlet for the other figures you can buy. I do have a sh YouTube short on this one. We got this little arrow back here. Oh, it just comes right out. This is a great looking figure out of package. The wings and the back here are going to be made out of a soft rubber as well as on top. This is this is a hard rubber, hard rubber face. There is no articulation in the legs. I don't even think, nope, they don't even swivel. So there really is absolutely no articulation in the body except for if you want to call this swivel and articulation, then that's, that's articulation for you, I guess. I was playing around with this figure, trying to figure out how this little feature here works. Um, I thought for sure that you would like attach it to this back arm, kind of like he was drawing the bow. But, you I mean, it doesn't at all. There's nothing you see on the hand here. There's nowhere for it to even attach any. I think you just literally push it back and... Oh, and suspense is building. Wait, is there a button? Earlier just shot out. I don't even... So. Whoa. See, it's not even working for me. So, I don't... hold on. Let's... Whoa! Okay, that just flew down my stairs. So, that's going to be a one-time deal. I don't think there's a button anywhere on here. So, I'm not sure. Yeah, there's, there's not a button. Overall, my opinion of this figure is that it's very underwhelming. As a collector, like an adult collector such as myself, you're kind of stuck with this because I can't think of any other Decidueye figures out there. This this is all I can think of. I'm not, unless you get like Scale World or something smaller. But if you want something articulated, you're pretty much limited with this. Uh, and I use articulated very loosely. So if you want to use something like six inch scale, then you're very limited with this. Um, kids may get some fun about it. I don't know, but it doesn't move at all. It's a very static pose, so I'm not even sure how my son would love it that much. I thought the arrow figure, as you saw it fly across I me, mean, it literally flew across the room. I don't know, it doesn't have a button or anything, so I don't even know if my four-year-old would be able to figure out this figure. I think it's going to look cool just sitting there on my shelf. Um, I almost think, personally, as this is as an adult collector, it would be kind of cool if it was all hard plastic. I'm not really seeing the use of the soft plastic here. Um, it would, would make it more statuesque, but at the end of the day, I don't... I mean, it's a statue. There's not much you can do with it. I mean, this soft plastic, I, don't, I just don't feel like it does it any favors. I thought it was going to be so that you could, like, you know, act like you're drawing the bow, but as you can see, I mean, they don't even meet. Thanks for watching, y'all. Have a great day. Be safe. Peace out.